Stan Lee national team can be summed up with a few words. Dedicated, talented, passionate, but more importantly, in modern times, a bloody roller coaster. Oh, no! Yep, this side has its ups and downs. More recently, July the 11th, 2021. As an England fan, I wanted to look away at this moment. But as a full-blooded Italian, you'll love to see it. Winning the European Championships on penalties. What a moment. And one year later from that, didn't even make it to the World Cup. You couldn't even qualify. Getting knocked out by North Macedonia out of all countries. Seriously. Well, I'll tell you what's going on right now. Mr. Hawks in charge. And he has one goal in mind. Restoring honour to the Italians, the Blues. And in his first ever international tournament, Euro 28. Yeah. There's some big countries in this tournament, but we've got some incredible players. And who knows, maybe with a little cockerel magic, Italy will win the Euros once again. Welcome, welcome, or should I say buongiorno everybody, to a special episode on my channel, as I will be doing my first ever time in international tournament. Yep, yeah, it's Euro 28. And I've chosen to be the manager of the Italian national team. Now I know I'm going to be in uncharted waters right here. First time I'm going to be doing an international tournament. But oh, I can't wait, especially with the Blues over here. The Italian national team. And yet this is my selection, my 26 man selection going into the Euros. I'll quickly go through it right here. This is pretty much going to be my starting lineup. First up, let's look at goal. Dollaruma, easiest choice by far. Then afterwards, fullback Destiny. We've got Calabria, centre backs Bastoni and Bari favourite Bongiorno. Centre midfield, I love the centre midfield right here. We've got Moretti, Bove, Barella. And finally, up forwards, Wilfred Goodnot, Ori Stiano and Musa King. We do see some other plays I did choose on the bench. You may recognise some Bari favourites right here. Yeah, I've gone with the Southgate option, but it well, if he could do it, I can certainly do it. I'm in charge here. That's the most important thing right here. I'm going to be in charge of this Italian squad going into Euro 28. The objective is pretty much going to be winning it right here. So, I'm all rated. Look at me. I'm all suited and booted for it. Let's get into our first game of the group stage. So, we're going to be doing the group stage like a match highlights. Our first opponent, Finland. Yeah, I did say we've got a hard group, but this is the easiest one of the bunch. So, we've got to get a win here. But Finland, they had a little surprise. Six at the bloody back. And yeah, it was really hard to break down this team's defence. And if I do, it was only ended up saving. Then I placed the pass into Wilfred Gunnar. He was unmarked. He's literally untouchable. And finally, he had to be the sledgehammer to break the finish wall down. Getting the first goal for us in the Euros. And it was pretty much the same. My defence was not going to be beaten that easily by this Finnish side. And the second half, well, they were absolutely even more tighter. And it was looking like I was not going to get a second goal past them. But wait a minute. Is that a bird? Is that a plane? Is that a Ferrari? Is it Lamborghini? No, it's Federico Chesnia. As he ran through this defence, as the finished defence only at his dust and secured a second goal for us. And well, we had to get a third somehow. And it's our own favourite, Oris Diano. What a shot. What a goal. We got our first win in the Euros in dominating fashion. And they don't come no easier than this, Portugal in our next game. But they're without a Cristiano Ronaldo. I think they would have needed him for this. Free kick came in, but it was just headed over. Ronaldo would have probably connected with that. But I'll tell you what, I really miss Wilfred Gunnar absolutely being a nightmare for all defence, big and small, getting another goal for us. But I'll tell you what was being a nuisance like a mosquito. This Ramos guy literally testing Dollaruma out. Well, luckily, he was making good saves until all of a sudden, Barella literally had the ball. He lost it with absolute ease. Portuguese was swarming in the box and Dollaruma could only get a fingertip, but it still went in for a Portuguese equaliser. And with that chance, Portuguese, well, they were applying more pressure on us. Hoping that will break and crumble right here. We almost came close to stealing it. Wilfred Gnott, but just not to be. But Moretti, he found Barella. 
can he redeem himself as he's literally one on one with the Portuguese goalkeeper and yet he's only done it. Sending a country into absolute panic stations. And to be fair honest with you, Portugal, they kind of really gave up as yet we've applied more goals to them and we've got another win of a much impressive Portugal side. And with the two wins, we're pretty much going through to the next round. So I pretty much swapped my whole 11 against Belgium over here. And Colombo over here, he was showing some great promise. Literally making some good saves. But oh my god, Jeremy Doku absolutely ruined Cambias over here. Thank you ever so much for the save. If not, that would have been something embarrassing. But we struck the Belgians right in their heart. As Federico, he couldn't get a shot off. But afterwards, Bolzini could. Beating Van der Voort and giving us the lead. That could have been three wins from out of three. But sadly, later on in the game, they wanted the result more than we do. And got a late equaliser. And they're going mad over it. We're going through to the next round of the Euros. So, I'll take that. Oh, mamma mia, we've got a hell of a challenge in the quarterfinals. As we've only drew against the bloody French. Oh, you know Mbappe's going to be playing. And who else is going to be playing for this French side? They've got a hell of a talent and I'm going to be absolutely... Ooh. Well, no, I don't think this depressing that soon. But I'll tell you who's going to be playing for us. So, after the group stage, I kind of guess which has been my negatives and cons. So, music in has been absolutely rubbish. So I've dropped him to the bench and put Wilfred up top. And for my left centre forward, Chiesa. So this is going to be my starting 11 to face the French. Now, don't be scared, boys. We've got to this for a reason. We're determined to beat the French once again. Come on, you Italian brothers. Let's bloody do this. Theo Hernandez. Uh, through balls it to the main man himself, Mbappe. Christopher Nduku, one two passing. Come on, we've got good. Nduku takes a shot, deflected. Oh, Dollaruma had to dive on there. Come on. No, this is not what I want. He's at one two. Theo Hernandez now. Teasing me, this French eye. Christopher Nduku, good save yet again from Dollaruma. Estoni. Now, it's been all France, and to be fair. If I can keep the second half nil nil, I'll take it. But hello, Oristiano, he's through. He's got a chance. But for the half, who would have thought? Struck in the French are. As Oristiano, oh, I want to do the cockle celebration. The Bari special as this centre forward gives us the lead in the quarterfinals. Half time. And you know what? French hearts will be absolutely devastated, deflated. After that, because it was all them, and yet all of a sudden, Oristi on a one on one, bang, up, uh, and they're shut up because of that. If we keep this up in the second half, that'll be bloody brilliant. Oh, we've got the ball. All right, now centre back lean from charge. Oh my god, that's selfish. That's stupid. Usman Dembele. Oh, dollar rumor. Oh, man, I can freaking kiss you. Not French kiss you because we're Italian. Well, let's hope we can deal with this corner though. Usman Dembele heads it away. Straight back into Caravinga. You know he's got a little scot at him. Oh, but Dollaruma yet again with another great save. It's how so long can this keeper saves us? Because, well, the French, they're knocking. And I don't want to be there. No one's home. Oh, hello, Oristiano, though. He's home. And he's going for a run. A little jog right here. The Italian walk right here. Oh, hello, he's off. Like a Ferrari. Come on. Go on, Oristiano. Plays it across. Barilla! Oh, come on! That would have been enough. There you go, Theo Fernandez. Now it's another front attack. And like I said, Dollaruma can't do much. That's a terrible clearance. Good clearance, and it's into Wilfred Gunnar. You know what? 1 2. As Federico over the top through balls. Wilfred Gunnar controls it well. He's only got one thing in sight. That's going to be the back of the net. Doubles our lead. And finally, a little breathing space against the French. 2-0 Italy. And well, you can see from the fans, they're absolutely devastated. And France. Italy are through once again. Just to at least reduce the deficit. But I'll tell you what, cleared it into Dollaruma. Full time goes. And it's been a solid defensive performance. As well as that, Dollaruma has been brilliant. 
but up forward we snatched it we break French hearts as we move to the semi-finals au revoir Mbappe our semi-finals at the Euros and we're against the Czech Republic out of all the teams you know what I was going to say this might be an easy road to the finals but they did knock out Germany so we might be in for a harder challenge when it comes to this side but you know what if we can beat the French, we can beat the Czechs. Come on, yet, Alien. Just one more game for the European finals. Come on, win the ball. This Czech side playing lovely. Bomb crossed it in. Get rid of it. What a clearance. But still, him into Adam. Linda plays across. Oh! Oh! Oh, was he off? No, it was just saved. Thank you, Dollaruma. Oh, my God. That was really close to making it 1 0. That would have been an upset as they've gone for a header again and Dolorum made a meal out of that but still saved it. My God, I can see why this Czech side has gone all the way further into down. Ah, oh, Dolorum saves it for the third time. Can it not be fourth, please? Oristiano. Bovo. No, Bove, sorry. I'm just trying to think. Oristiano now lays it into Moretti. Into Friederico. Into Wilfred Gunnar. Oh, that's beautiful. We take our chances here as Wilfred Gunnott scores. There we go. Taste tribute to the manager with the cock celebration. 1 0. Adam. No. Oh my god. This side is full of surprises. And here they come yet again. This check side. Drills round. Plays it across. 1 2 again. Oh, Donald Ruba catch it. Oh, thank you for that. Now, here they go. This check side. I don't want them on the ball. Because they do position goal. There we go. There we go. Here comes our chance. Orsiano. Lovely work. Find him. There we go. Barella. Lovely ball into Moretti. Have a nice call. After oh, finish. Oh, nice and relaxing. Just like literally having a glass of Moretti. I'm such an alcoholic. But I'll tell you what. I'll have a red wine after this. Because we're 2-0 up against the Czechs. Oh, wait. Come on. There we go. Destiny. What a tackle. Now into Federico. Through balls at Wilfred Gunnar. It's an easy stroll. It's an easy walk. Will he make it free? He makes it 3 0. We just outclass. Got world class players in our squad. That's the difference. They've had their chance. They squandered. We take our chances. We absolutely punish them for it. Half time. And you know what? I'm happy enough to say it. We're going to the finals, boys. There's going to be no historical underdog moment like the Greece did in Euro 2000. Federico. Over the top through ball into Wilfred Gnott. Lovely work. See, it was such a good idea playing with striker. Now it's into Oristiano. Good save from the keeper. Yeah, no, I'll be frustrated too, mate. Really need to get another goal. Moretti, though, whips this one in. Headed up in the air into Wilfred Gnott, who heads it back down. Bastoni, Wilfred, oh, couldn't get nothing on it. Headed poorly now. And it's 1-2. Moretti now, good work from him. Plays it across, Federico, he's got afterburners, you know, let's find him. Ballerina uh, plays it across, lovely, oh, good save again from the Czech keeper. Corner for him. Now, uh, if we can just steal this and go for a headed Dollaruma. Thank you for the save, and oh, oh, no, oh, no, I meant to, oh, no, this is disaster. Oh, you got to be kidding me, he sent off. Oh, Captain Bastoni, I was meant to clear it, not sly tackle. Oh, my God. We're g no, I don't care about the penalty. Our captain could potentially miss the Euro finals. Oh, my God. This is a disaster. Oh, Dollaruma, just at least make this moment not as bad as it is. And, God, thank you so much. Went the right way. Great save. Through balls. Come on. Nope, here they go again. Adam, now you see, I'm a man down, and they're making the best of it onside. That's what happens when you lose your best defender. My defence opened up, and the Czechs have pulled one back. Come on, God, oh, lost it with ease. Adam, now I'm just so irate. Moretti, he's won it. Come on, over the top through ball. Musa Kane, there we go. 4-1, we've pretty much got this game wrapped in the bag, but I'm still absolutely devastated over the sending off of Bastoni. Lovely run from him. Through balls. Now, oh, cross it in. Unmarked man. 
You know, if Bastoni was there, he would have probably marked him. Oh, for crying out loud. Yeah, you think you're so strong. You're still two goals down, mate. Here they come again. Literally, I'll be more heartbroken if they get this in for crying out loud. That means only one goal away of making it a 4-4 draw. Here they come. No, I'm marked, Dollaruma. Thanks, mate. I really do appreciate it. You're putting a top-class performance in this comp tournament so far. Just going to make some changes. Defensive. Keeper is up. 85th minute. These checks are going for it. It's going to be cleared. Headed away. Now. Oh, hello. Music in. Goalkeeper off his line. Dribbles round defence. Going to go for it. It's going to be in. It's an absolute beauty. Keeper off his line. Music in. Went for it. 5 2 winner to the Italians. What a goal, I have to say. That's cheered me up a bit. Full time. And the Italians are going to the Euros final once again. Absolutely brilliant. Well, not really, because at what cost? We lost our captain for the final. So this finals is going to be really, really intense for the Italians. European finals were against the Dutch. One game away for European glory for the Blues. But, oh no, we haven't got our captain. He's been suspended, so he can't even play in the finals. All right, we're going to put Mancini in there instead. So, this is the squad going into Euro 28 finals. Can we do a historical moment and win the European champions once again? Come on, you Blues. We've got a whole country backing us this time. Destiny. Lovely run from him. Come on, find someone lovely. Loads of space right here. Come on, Orsiano blocked. Oh, damn it. See, defenders are putting on the line right here. The Dutch surely don't want to trail first. If you saved it with his kneecaps, Timber couldn't be beaten. Can we get some from a corner? Corners have not been my specialty so far. And up in the air, Wilfred Gunnar heads it back down into Moretti. Now uh, plays it short, one, two, come on, come on, come on, oh, oh, what's going in? Oh, come on, you can't do me like that. De Jong, lovely dribble from him now, come on, can't, got to steal it off him and go for it. Oh no, back heels at Graven Birch, oh, 1-0 to the Dutch. Netherlands take the lead, oh, maybe that would be the effect of a no world-class centre-back, but I don't care regardless. We trail for the first time in the Euros. We're a goal down. Let's try and respond well. Come on. Federico plays it across. Wilfred Gnott. He's got a man on him. No, he hasn't. Go on. Takes a shot. Oh, it's going to go in this time. Oh, don't do me like that for crying out loud. You utter teasing me. Bowen. Destiny. Lobs it to Federico. Lovely good shot. Oh, Wilfred Gunnar. Orsiano. He's by himself. He's by himself and got an equaliser. Oh, it just had to be the Bari special. The cockerel to produce a little bit of magic. And got us back an equaliser. We were knocking on that Dutch door. Well, here's his bat around for you. Of the name of Orsiano. Oh, no. This Dutch side. Yeah, come on, come on. Oh, I couldn't tackle him. No, I've got to do a lot better. That's a lot better. Federico through balls it. Look who's on Mart. Orisiano's got himself a brace. Oh, gets in. Oh, come on. I want to do the cockle special. Pays tribute to the manager. But you know what? You already pay tribute to me, mate. We're finally taking the lead in the finals. Oh, plenty more chances. I love that. Lovely dummy. Plays it across to Federico. Oh, got tackled by Barella. Should have put that on target, mate. The Dutch really want to get something before the half. And I'll be breaking. Oh, good tackle from Mancini. Really stepping up. Come on. Wilfred Cunot. He's going to send through Orsiano. He's one-on-one -on -one to make it free to break Dutch hearts. But the keeper managed to save it. All right, that's going to be half time now. I'm quite happy about that, to be honest with you. Yeah, we took a rocky start conceding, but to be honest with you, I feel like I can score a lot more goals against this Dutch side. This defence is breakable. I'm going to bring an Italian sledgehammer to that Dutch wall. I'm going to turn it to nothing but rubble. Gravenberch now, the goal scorer. 
Makes a good pass into the bully. Galang, no, come on, get to him, get to him. Bro! Bro, oh, Jesus. Man, that would have been not a good start to the second half. Now they're playing it back now, and that's not going to be a nice move because they're going to make a mistake. Come on. Oh, lovely tack from the centre back. Now plays again. Orsiano now. Trying to find someone cross. Didn't go that well. Moretti plays got the bow. Now he sees a Litchi. Morella is in open space, open time. I told you I could score against this Dutch side, and I have not proven you wrong at all. Morella, and I think that might be the icing on the Italian cake, and Euro 28 should belong to the Blues. De Litt clears it from the back. Van der Van into Darry. Oh, God, it's through board. And he's going to be free right. Down with Cody Gatbody. He has to be taken out. No, no, no. Oh, I was having bad deja vu. Not the nice current as well. You already lost one good defender. You don't want to lose another now, do you? Are you going to change? Johnson's a free kick now. If I can just clear this away, I can get it to Wilfred or not. You know the drill. Okay, don't clear it. Dull the room with Mystic Punch. And well, that's 3 2. The Dutch have got a lifeline. Here they go again. No, this is not what I need, especially in the 89th minute. We just got to defend now. This is where I probably need the story right now. Oh no, through. No, don't get him in. Open chance, Frankie Dion. Oh no, open man, and he absolutely saves them. I can't believe it. Three one up. I was cocky. I was confident we were gonna get it, and it's three three. Oh my goodness. Full time goes. We're all square. Oh, we had it. We had it in the palm of our hands and then we just let it slip. We've got to go to extra time. Come on, through balls it now. Chavi Simon, come on the bench, fresh man. Through balls. No, no, no. Oh, Dollaruma saves us. Oh, don't do that to me. My defence are leaving massive holes right here. This is, like I said, I need my captain. But he's probably only do is watch on the sidelines in horror. Ah, oh, Dollaruma misses it again. Just please. Ah, oh, Dollaruma saves it again. Please don't do this to me. Oh, for crying out loud. All right, let's get him on the counter. Barella. Now, see so many. Oh, God. Come on. Is someone going to make a run? Moose King. Fresh in the daisy. Pass one defence. Come on. Steal it. Come on. Oh, he had a man holding him on. It unbalanced the shot. All right, come on. Find someone. Here we go. Into chair. Now plays it to his footballery teammate, Oris Diano. He's got Dutch orange hearts around him. No, plays it across. Couldn't get it. Music in. Grabs it, though. All right, we've got the ball from midfield. Now chair. Through balls at Music in now. Absolutely ruins the defence. Come on. He's by himself. Redeem yourself. Music in. I'll take everything back I said about you being rubbish. Because that is the goal with extra time to lift a nation up. Oh, we've done it. 4-3, it's absolute pandemonium here. I'll tell you that. Free kick again, and you may remember they did score from this position before, but they go for goal this time with Dollaruma. Could easily catch on to that. Now, if I try and look for the there we go. Now, play it nice and easy, Destiny. We don't want to slip now, let these Dutch get back in this. Wilfred Gunnar, through balls it. Orestiano. He sees a man on Mart. It's only the hero, Musa Keats, to secure the Euros. We've done it, folks. It's a historical day as Mr. Hawk wins his first international trophy. Full time goes. And like I said before, I've won the Euros with the Italian side. Italy are champions of Europe once again. It's been such a good moment for this side. Literally, I thought we were going to slip. Just like we did so many times, but Italy have come out prevailed. It's tied. I wish I could have taken for a World Cup, but Mr. Hawke, he's got duties elsewhere. Thank you for joining me in this special, I was going to say one-off tournament, but maybe I'll do another international team. But thank you for joining me in this Euro special. If you enjoyed, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. And as always, I'll see you lot. Wait a minute. This is more appropriate. Ciao, everybody. Tu
Tuvo fala americano, tuvo fala americano.